Hey everybody, welcome to Arkham Horror the Card Game. We are back in our adventure of the Forgotten Age. This time, the City of Archives. Travis, take it away. Intro one. You remember very little of the next few days. Your consciousness fades in and out your body grips with exhaustion, and your mind feebly attempts to comprehend what exactly is happening to you. The inhabitants of this place are the same creatures you saw Alejandro consorting with. Immense corrugated clones, cones of clammy flesh with four thick limbs extending from the top. They are horrifying to look upon, but they do not harm you as you expected they might. Your first few days are spent restrained and questioned by the creatures, several of which are somehow able to communicate in English. Others reproduce their language using an odd futuristic machine played like a musical instrument. You're reminded strangely of the jazz piano of the nightingale. It's only then you realize your body has been altered. You have no hands or fingers to play the keys, no legs to walk upon, no lungs to scream out. You're one of them now. One of the creatures that is taking you captive, and your original body is nowhere to be seen. Despite your captivity, the creatures do not seem intent on harming you. Instead, they merely interview you, asking all manner of questions about a broad range of topics. Your society, your profession, Ooh. your technology, your ecosystem, your human body. And let's take a second and appreciate them asking us about a profession. We have a thief, a guy who goes looking for things, and like try to explain what a priest is. Yeah, none of us get paid. <laughs> yeah. You get grants. Yeah. I steal. You don't need money because you, you live in fucking like Shia. Yeah. <laughs> oh, like people just give me money because yeah. that's how. Because that's what God would want. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, their thirst for knowledge is unyielding, unending. Their questions range from the mundane to the complex. They implore you to write copiously in your own language, taking anything you write to store away in their vast archives. You're informed that you'll be able to roam the city freely if you comply. So, <laughs> are we to gonna the tell them? Cooperate and tell the creatures everything we know, or refuse and resist captivity. Or... Oh, I think Finn would refuse. So that's what I'm gonna play the flavor. I don't think he would cooperate, unless he thinks cooperating, you know, like. But then he's he can he's gonna tell the truth. I'm gonna I'm gonna say resist, resist. What do you think? Expedition leader. They ask us such complex questions as, what happens if you sneeze and fart at the same time? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that doesn't happen. <laughs> I'm 45 years old, and that has never once happened. Yeah. <laughs> Head yet in. Useless. These ones are useless. <laughs> I think Matthew would be too disheartened by... He'd feel like God has abandoned him. <laughs> he would definitely be like, God is not real. God would not let this happen to me. Yeah. So would he give in then and just cooperate? Yeah, I guess. Yeah. All right, Leo, you These literally are the get new a gods now. You get a li literally yeah. split the vote. Great. I love it. If it makes a difference, cooperating is intro two and refusing is intro three. Whew. Jeez. Um. So, just some stuff I see right here. Each copy of the Athena Observer gains a loof. That might only be the case if we cooperate. Right. Like, it might be like, ignore Justin the text on Act 1. He was like, ah, fuck these guys. I mean, I'm just playing my character. <laughs> which is what you're supposed to do on your first time through. Yeah, this is like, campaign number three. <laughs> I don't know. And then maybe... Well, let's not tell them anything. Sure. Resist? Yeah. These creatures abducted you and even stole from your own body. You refuse to give your captors even a single answer. You'd spit in their faces if you could. If you knew how to spit with such a body, and if you knew which one of the creature's four distendable appendages was a face. Breaking free of your restraints is a hopeless endeavor, but you struggle to escape regardless. Your efforts do not go unnoticed, and one of the creatures is assigned to watch you. It seems more concerned with preventing you from harming your body than preventing you from escaping. After many days of captivity, you find a way to use this to your advantage. You struggle so hard against your restraints that they pierce into your leathery, leathery cold flesh, drawing out a bit of viscous slime blood. Your guard quickly approaches, clicking his claws together repeatedly, and then does your restraints. And the moment it does, your claws like your claw appendages just strike what you believe to be the creature's throat. <laughs> it collapses to the floor, writhing in pain. God, we're such assholes. Resisted. Captivity. Great. <laughs> so I would have had that guy join us. I mean, like, yeah, if we had been nice, they would have just been like, yeah, oh. you can go do things. <laughs> anyway, well, uh, we got some steps for you. We're humans, we're free will. We have free will, free will. I don't, I'm a priest. 
God's will, God's will. Before drawing opening hands, each investor searches his or her deck and play area for all unique item assets. Set each of those assets aside of play that do not exist in this time period. Oh, unique item assets. Can I set aside Mitch Brown? No. Why does he have to exist? If player has Alejandro Vela in their deck, he is taken out. That's all right. This card is one that I would prefer really not to. No, do. my this really you. good Relic of Ages would have been great in this scenario. This is you now. Man, that would have been plus fucking six. Uh, can I put this with your set aside cards, or? Yeah, sure. I guess. All right. Uh, check campaign log. We did not cooperate with the Athenians. We are going to start in the restraining chamber. That's been formed as one of the three interview locations. Restraining room. Restraining room. What's going on this view now? These also go into play, but face down. Interview rooms. Cuto. We use this to captivity. I have more sanity in this body. Search for the things. For a Yithian observer, and oh. place it in the victory display because we punched him in the throat. Oh, sick! <laughs> <laughs> I am here to help. Got Boom. Me good. <laughs> no, no, you're gonna hurt yourself if you do that. Boom. <laughs> got there. Uh, we got some fancy location. So they want the interview rooms vertical. These ones vertical, okay. Yeah, and then we got green halls to pin off. No, like on the far side, though. Green hall. And then we got brown hall. And then we got I red hall. to bring the connector tokens. This might have been a good one for them. Set the custodian you side of the play. Nothing. Yeah. I blame you. Fine. Okay. Uh, body of a Yithian. Yes, that's me. That's and you. And me. Yeah. Uh, each investigator's deck remains the same for the duration of the scenario. He or she must use a body at the end of the investigator card, and they cannot use any of their. This is you. This is your card. Checks out. Uh, Am I should, still indebted in this timeline? Yes. Each investigator should still use their investigator mini card so they can tell who is who. Please take this. Give me four of these. Who am I? Uh, any trauma you still have, any cards that were attached to you or placed underneath your investigator card are still there. Mm, it's still poison. Uh, here, for the duration of the scenario, your body of the Athena is the same cartel as your former investigator card, so I'm still Father Matteo. Nice. I'm still good old sexy Finn Edwards. Yeah. Okay. And, uh... Good luck. Yeah, let's, uh, let's do it. Alright, City of the Great Race. Somehow you have awoken in a futuristic, futuristic city inhabited by odd alien creatures beyond your imagining. Uh, you must explore this strange place if you're to find a way out, but your new body is difficult to get used to. Item Investigators cannot put item assets into play, including mm, item weaknesses. Exploring Nakatis. I assume we don't pronounce the P like a pterodactyl, so that's what I want to do. Getting out of this Nakatis. strange city might be harder than you thought. Its halls are endless and filled with all manner of complex futuristic machinery. Each copy of Yithian Observer has a loof. We start in the interview room. Uh, four shroud, one clue. Uh, sorry, one clue per player, one victory. As an action parlay, test book four or f uh, fist four to interview the captive mind restrained here. If you succeed, remember that you interviewed a subject. If you fail, take two horror. I hope I don't draw my life serpent of the weakness because I think it's going to fuck me up. <laughs> so, um... For people watching at home, a Yithian is we have two for every stat, seven and seven for health and sanity. Uh, each of our ally assets gain the Yithian trait. Uh, and then as a reaction, after you commit a card to a skill test, you're performing double the skill icons on that card limit once per test. And the star is just plus two, draw one card. All right. Yeah, let's do it. Hmm. You are an item asset, so you can go away. And we're going to go with these ones. Haha, <laughs> see you later, weakness. <laughs> cool, does anyone want to take the first turn while I'm shuffling? Yeah, I'll do, uh, holy shit, four. <laughs> we only have two. <laughs> Book or punch a... <laughs> I, was looking, I was looking at your stats, you're like, which one's best for Trappist? <laughs> <laughs> Something's not right. Play Instagram. <laughs> She's a Yithian. Yeah, Michelle gives me plus one bucks. That's pretty neat. I'll take that bag and I'll try and do this parley do. So three to four? 
five to five four. Five to four. And we don't want. Uh, no tombstones. Do we have tombstones in our bag? No, you're right. No, um, no men. We have two of those. See you later, man. Boom. Minus one, that's a success. Yeah, we, that's what we... So you remember <laughs> that we interviewed a subject. Okay. You want to grab me a piece of paper? I'll, like, screw... Actually, I just use the back of this. Oh, okay, yeah, here, here, there's... Okay. Right there. Interview um, the subject. This makes me think of the, uh, insane asylum when we had to, like, do things. So let's just do everything we can. When a thing happens, we say yes. <laughs> can we do a thing? Yes. And I have another action. I'll go to this other Hall of Pinocchus. This one? Yeah. Go for it. Eastern Corridors. Triggered Billy. During your turn, choose and discard a card from your hand. Move to another copy of Hall of Pinocchus. Limit once per turn. One clue here. Three. Shroud. Well, I'll just do that. <laughs> so, choose and discard a card from your hand? Oh, yeah, yeah. No, actually, I don't want to do that. This card's good. <laughs> Um, Finn was always taught to be prepared. I forgot that it cost. So he set an emergency cache in here. In another timeline. <laughs> in another timeline. He knew things would get out of hand. And then he also met his good friend, Leo. Oh, I'm glad you're still here and also a Yithian. <laughs> That's pretty convenient. Oh, fuck, why can't I do math? I have three left. Because you're a Yithian. Yeah. Probably. You started with five, you gained three. You can't spend even, five. You can't even count on your fingers because you've got, like, weird claw hands now. Yeah. Um... I think we're gonna, this seems like this could be good here, so we're just gonna put out some hyper-awareness. Yeah, that's cool. And then I have one action left, I'm gonna grab a resource. So how many item assets do you have in your hand? None, I'm all them all that's away. That's good. I have one that finds one, though. <laughs> what champ? Uh, yeah, like, I'll draw a card, I guess. So I'm happy we killed oh, that. Cool. Ethan is over, that felt pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'll play an emergency cache. Nice. And play Brother Xavier. Nice. So we all found one of our friends as Yithians. Yeah. Is that everybody's actions? Dollar. Card? Card. Dang, you're an item, huh? Uh, evil card starting with Brynn. There's also some Doom. Boom. Bad card. Hmm, that's not good. Uh, let's make this... Uh, -huh. uh four, five. This card is insane. Lost humanity, test brain five. For each point you fail by, remove the top ten card to the top card of your deck from the game. If there are fewer than ten total cards in your hand, deck, and discard pile, you are driven insane. Dark days. Shit. I'm a scholar. We're gonna be friends. Amazing. All right, we're going to just test uh, two to five. Oh. So yeah, if you get down to ten oh. cards, like you should probably power through it. Yeah, plus one. Uh, so we fail by two. We remove <laughs> pickpocketing and cheap shot from my from the game. Brutal. Okay. So you get you get them back. Like after the, the end, end. Yeah. yeah. Like assuming you're not dead or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Okay, our turns again. Her little friend. I'll. I'll parley with him. It's so scary. Let's do the thing. Oh no. So he'll attack me and I just could get real close to my head. Why don't you just punch him? Because Give him I don't the bomb. Want to punch him. Oh. This is bullshit. Two cards? <laughs> yeah. Okay, I don't want those ones. It's emergency cash and guts. <laughs> oh, we're gonna try and. Like. Man. Yeah. 
What's up, Brandon? I mean, like, we're gonna try to talk to the friend. No, we're just gonna. Oh, try to invade the man. Oh, like I never seen this symbol before. This is a member. Brown swirl. Yeah. Okay. We'll just sprint right. We'll just punch him. T T. I'll fucking get you. Good luck punch him. Piece of shit. <laughs> you deserve that. Just come in swinging. Probably we throat punch that one if he was there. He has four. He didn't see it coming. Oh no, he's punched me on someone for coming help me rumble this guy. <laughs> cool. I'll punch this guy. Thanks, bud. Or you. No, 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 get him. I like how they have the same stats, like this is just a Yithian. Yeah, We're just yeah. Yeah, this is run the mill Yithian. Ooh. Ow. Do you want me to try again? Yeah. Alright, so cool. I think I care. <laughs> Oh, oh, he's dead. Him. Thanks, Brent. All right, that's my turn. Okay. You saw the freshness. This one's really hard. <laughs> well, let's uh try to grab some clues because that's the objective, right? Good luck. I'll have four to four. I will do <laughs> five to four. Math, Justin, it's hard. I'm gonna use this little tile card in my deck. Oh, I'll place one of my clues on the location. Well, don't have any. This one is hard. Um, maybe we shouldn't be doing this getting one. clues. Maybe we should be exploring. I agree with that. So I'm going to check out one of these interview rooms, another one. Yeah. So we'll go That's two, good. three. Uh, after you be in your turn in this location, if there's a Yithian enemy at this location, draw one card. There's no clues here. Uh, so then I'll come back and join you guys in the party room. So Which one, two, three, four. Arrival chamber. How long you must be new here? Uh, end of turn. Cards and resources. <clears throat> oh, that's an item. That is an item. Long bad cards. Bryn. Travis. <laughs> All right, pal. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. We don't have that location, you idiot. <laughs> Oh, this guy's cool. This is the coolest card I've seen in this game. Uh, test brain zero, regardless of whether the skill test succeeds or fails, choose and discard all but X cards in your hand, where X is the modified skill result. That's it's neat. neat. It is neat. Wow, my brain is two? So you want to succeed by a lot or fail by a lot? Uh, I want to get... <laughs> I need to get at least plus one. How important are the cards in your hand? Uh, not that important, like, at all. Oh, okay. So we're just going to go. If I discard the cards... Well, then I can get negative one, too. No, because it can't go below zero. Right? Zero is the lowest it can go for a modifier. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep. Bye. Bye. Neat. Hey, Brent. Are you going to punch this guy out? you going to rough up this guy, too? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Whew. This, is, this has been the plan for, like, deck. minute one, right? <gasps> oh, oh, sick. Oh, plus two and draw a card. That doesn't do anything. <laughs> Punch. All right, let's no, punch we're using one of your six red dice, not my no. like one of two. No. <laughs> I'll commit this because uh, it's worth two punch. It's worth two punch. Four to two. And honestly, I'm not gonna go looking for a weapon. There's no point. No. Oh, nice try, me. All right, two to two. Yeah, mm. cool. That's fine. I didn't draw a card, so I use a scrim. Let's talk around that kind of it's fucking sick. I'll play the strip on level three. That's not an own item. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you like this shit, you think? <laughs> uh, are you, okay, so do you it's want me to like... I can just duke it out with this guy. I'm not going to do a whole lot this game. My deck is very item-centric. Okay. Well, I'll just move to one of these places. You want to go to this interview room or keep uh, exploring yeah, the cottage? Let's go check out the other interview room. Uh, forest, after you, this location, after you enter this location, test brain three. Take one horror for each point you fail by. But it's one shroud and three clues. So what and you're saying it. is there's a chance. Yeah. I don't really want to take any brain damage, so I'll have plus four brains for this, I think. Wow, so six brain? There's so three times. I still believe in God. It's not as good! I get to draw two but cards, so. <laughs> Yeah, it's not free action. Draw two cards? Oh, yeah, yeah for this. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, you have two actions left. What? No, I drew a card and played Shrivelin. Oh, so, oh, then you have no actions left. Okay, cool. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna move up here. We're gonna explore. No, I'm done. 
<laughs> what new fresh hell is this? Uh, during your choose and discard a card from your hand, move to another copy of Hall of Nakatas. Three and one. These look eerily similar. I think that we're going to need to advance the list to unlock new locations. I think so as well. Um, I need six, man. I'm sorry. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I'm going to try out this last one just to see if there's any difference. Yep. They're not. They're all the same. Neat. Uh, so then we're just going to investigate. Uh, who? I feel like we're going to need a lot more room for this uh, map. Uh, I have four to two. Sorry, four to three. That's not good. We're going to go five to three. So you and I need to do the investigating as usual. Yeah. Oh, I get one. Uh, so and then for my last bonk. one, we're going to grab a resource. Oh, yeah. And we're discarding the cards to do <laughs> This is great. I do like how you came into the halls when I was rubbing that guy. It was like two of you just flail on their arms at each other. And you're like, I'll get I that just one. <laughs> one. Yeah. Uh, uh, ever end a turn, draw cards, gain resources. Uh, it's like, so thanks, Leo. And you, guy you were like, cards. yeah, I knew it was you. Excuse me. Bong. Ooh, I need that. Oh, here you go. This is dirt. Yeah, that means that I also need that, right? No. It has surge. But in oh, if we haven't. Era, if you have What? It's if you happen to gain search. If an investigator has interviewed a subject, take one horror and cruel inter interrogations gain search. Oh, we totally did. That's the yeah, one we like did. That's do. the thing we did. Wow, sick. I cannot take draw actions. That's fine. I'm not doing that anyway. Yeah, no. Uh, like, there's that? there's no library, horror, right? No, nah, that guy's dirt. Woo! <laughs> Give me some of this brain tested. Fucking. Holy shit. Oh, shit. Man, we could just like melt from this, eh? <laughs> Two to three. Like, what do these things do? They sit in play and make things harder for me. <laughs> you just can't take draw actions? So I can't take a draw action off this one. This one says that if there's an Egyptian enemy at my location, I cannot investigate that location or use abilities of that location that require an action. I can still punch this guy. Yeah, like I can still punch this <laughs> just guy. Just solidifies your role as punch, man. <laughs> Hello, I am man to punch. I'm going to punch this guy. <laughs> Okay, I can get some of the clues off that like super hard interview room, Justin. You should do this one first. I don't have any clues. I'll punch like I'm going guy. to. I'm just saying okay. in the future. Cool. Because then if you do these ones, we would if you get one off. If you this, have the resources, zero. you can. Okay. If you can get one resource off this, if you sink a bunch of money into it. Of this one? Yeah. Sure. With That'll your be hyper awareness. Yeah. Oh, okay. Like and if you can get these like ones, one more action. Better. But um, give that guy some punch. You fools not bring your spells with you. I mean, I brought Leo. I have talents. Uh, I actually do have a lot of talents. Mm -hmm. My lock picks, which would have been great, they don't work. I don't know. No, my hands don't. don't my hands don't work. I'll try to investigate here, I guess. Yeah. yeah this is this is uh, the scariest. Is, this is a good one. Yeah. <laughs> let's make this four because this card doesn't do anything. I can't put items into play. <laughs> four, two, three. <gasps> oh, we got there. No, I have to worry about failing tests. So we need four more clues. All right. If I get, if you get these ones, I can get this one, and we can advance this. Investigate. And then the observer is no longer. Boom. No deal. Investigating. Boom. Deal. Yes, because you have plus one book. Yeah, I brought this woman who can, you know, she knows things. Investigating. Boom. Yeah. Minus Good two. Clue. Is there actions? Yeah, I'm gonna look at the top card of the encounter deck. Please. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> that sounds like an enemy that can't spawn. <laughs> no. What makes you think that? Um. I think I'm just gonna. Discard a card, move here, get this clue, discard a card, move here. Then move here, and then investigate for the last clue. And also take a brain test. Yeah, yeah uh, I think I'm actually just gonna gain four resources. All right. just... <laughs> like I laid out a perfect game plan for you, Justin. Yeah. I told you exactly what to do. You didn't do it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bong. 
Thank you. Laboratory of the Great Race. You idiot, think I'm gonna play assets and events in this one? No. All I do is gain resources. Man, do you know what would be good? Oh, actually, funnily enough, this one works against higher education. Yeah. I was gonna say higher education would be good here, but it actually is against it. Kind of. Which is like, if you're too smart, like it's still the Ithians really will target you. It's still very good, I agree. This one has a degree. Yeah. <laughs> Get him. That was a pretty soft turn. No, it will Well, on this yet. I like how this one has been used in now three, Two. like they include in the core set. Oh yeah. And like No, nope. all of us get. Good luck, good luck. Bam. Minus three. I have a million cards. You have yeah, I said no. minus three. No. I will investigate again. I'm not gonna change anything. I'm just gonna hope that this works out. Cool, then I'll try to get this one this turn. The communist Ethiopian one. state. Everyone is equal. Except some of them. So we're gonna go. Some are more equal. Three. Than yeah, I got punched four, in the throat. Five, six. Stupid Ethiopian bit. <laughs> we're gonna have six to three. <sighs> See ya. Shall we advance? Yes. Yeah, that way I don't have to worry about failing tests. And put you explore the area, you're going to need to like shuffle these a bit. I like, very squish them You explore the area near your interview chamber for some time, learning more of the city and its dwellers. There's a place of knowledge and research inhabited by beings who call themselves the Great Race of Yith. For most part, the Yithians allow you to explore the city without troubling you, though some of them follow you about and observe you with keen interest. As you pass through one of the city's meandering <clears throat> halls, you find a panel attached to the wall. It's a technological device you cannot hope to understand. As you stand in front of it, dumbfounded, one of that your observers you approaches it. cautiously. It extends one of its claw appendages and manipulates the pattern in a convoluted manner. To your surprise, the wall in front of you slides open to reveal another series of halls. The creature steps aside to let you pass. Please set aside location to play. Great library. Laboratory of the Great Abyss. Yithianori. Deconstruction room, excuse me. <laughs> it sounds metal as fuck. And the tower's Pinocchus. Choose one of those locations at random. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Laboratory of the Great Race. This is our friend, the custodian. Oh, curious Yithian. When investigate, the investigation page begins, if you control the custodian, each investigate this location draws a card. Action. If the custodian is not controlled by a paler, parlay test book to read to converse with the library custodian. If you succeed, something about its mannerisms seem familiar to you. Place one of your clues on it, then if there are... One clue per player, we take control. Uh, Ethan Zero's no longer aloof. Act 2A, restricted access. You have to find a way home. Surely if the Ethans can bring you this place, there might be a way to return. If three of the following are true, you must advance. Uh, and it's like five things plus an investigator controls the custodian. Cool. And we have one of them? Yeah. Interview the subject. <laughs> what a map. Right, okay, I have two actions left. No more videos, yet him observers come up, I'll get them now. Let's uh, move into the laboratory. I got like a little bit of punch. <laughs> yeah, I got some brain for him. If there are no clues on the laboratory of the great race, test foot three to manipulate the controls on the technological device nearby. If you succeed, remember that you have activated the device. Oh, if you fail, that. place one clue on the laboratory of the great race from the token pool. Three clues here, so this is enough that I could stay here for a bit. I just... Grab these clues, then try to put them on the custodian. And try to do the thing, yeah. So I moved, investigated, moved. I have one action left. Um, I mean, what's the harm in just investigating two to two? None right now. Nope. Low risk, risk, no risk. I'm a pro. <laughs> so good. <laughs> so uh, you should do this ability before we draw. Okay. I guess it moves, so. Oh, yeah, Brent hasn't gone. I haven't. Because you can actually doom it to the bottom. Like, I'll move to the halls. Because this is how we get to, like, all of these ones, right? Yeah. No, this one is... Yeah, they all have different... I tried to put them as close as I could. So this one's also connected Brian, here. where are you going? 
I don't know. Okay, well, you should go someplace with clues. Like, I'll go here. And uh, let's uh, let's test this cruel interrogations. Yeah, just sit here and do these things. Boom. Oh, oh wow. wow. Must be let's nice. Let's do it again. Watch this. Swish. Kobe. No. He's retired. Yeah. <laughs> uh, end of turn. Dollar you. Carter you. <clears throat> See you later. Sick. That's an item. Bomb. As you traverse these strange halls, you come across a chamber you hadn't noticed before. It is filled with trinkets and items of all kinds from various civilizations. Oh, Many of them match the descriptions you have given to the city and ha city's inhabitants. Descriptions of the equipment you had on your person when you first encountered the creatures. Have they somehow replicated the objects you had with you? You take what you can find and continue exploring. Each investigator mm -hmm. searches the top nine cards of his or her deck for up to two item cards and draws them. Shuffle this each search deck. Nine cards? Yep. I found my shiny dude and my light stick. I found lockpicks and some alcohol. <laughs> Trying to explain why. So, like, what did you lose? Uh, it's alcohol. It's, uh, <laughs> you drink it because you're just feeling nice. nice yeah. I like that this is what the Indians, this is what the Indians prioritize. They're like, what is this strange substance? But they like, their music, they're like, ding, 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 ding. <laughs> um, shuffle the encounter, discard pile with the encounter deck. If the custodian oh, is in yeah. play and not controlled by an investigator, move to, to the location with the most clues on it. These are both tied, so would we like to keep them here? Yeah. Sick. That's what we want. Agenda 2A, Lost Memories. Little by little, the memories of your former life are starting to fade. The most recent events are the first to disappear, but <clears throat> soon you will begin to lose your grip on your human identity. I'm scared. Each investigator's maximum hand size is reduced by two. Six? <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I wish I had more resources to play my sick cards. Um, we have to draw evil cards. Oh, it's all shuffled, so yeah, Melissa yeah, Graham... Whatever. The useless. She tried. She did. She's she like, did. I foresee something, but I psychics don't but exist. I don't know what so. it is. And it's gone. <laughs> What'd you draw? <laughs> What'd you draw? No, no, it's good. It's good. <laughs> well, oh fuck! This I guy's with me. We're just never doing this one. Some help, Justin. No, I will just evade him. <laughs> oh, he's aloof. Yeah, he is aloof until we activate the device or dissect an organ. That's the one that you're trying to do. Yeah, yep. yeah, yeah. Eh. I mean, the custodian is my priority number uno. I mean, can first. we have items now? We can. Yeah. Good. Because that other one, otherwise, that would just be like a cruel joke. Yeah. <laughs> These are all the things that you loved, but you can't. I'm super mm. Indian. I had to discard one. It'll be, like, decorated skull. So I definitely had this little shiny bit that made me better at everything. Yep. <laughs> you should make me one of those. <sighs> you should seal the, seal the blue one because it's strictly better than plus one right now. <laughs> yes, Bren, you're right. Wow. The whole world is nice. I'll move to the halls of Nopkiss. Which one? Bopkiss. The one I can. <laughs> um... Man, do you guys remember when I could evade for free? I guess I'll roll into the deconstructed room and see what's going on there. All right. Three shroud, three clues. Test fist four to attempt to retrieve a valuable organ from one of the alien cadavers. This right. test gets plus one difficulty for each clue on deconstruction room. If you succeed, remember you dissected the organ. I would like it if you waited a bit. Don't be like that, Justin. I want to do science too. I do science better than you because I use God for it. It's true. Oh, that's all my actions. Well, I've got a knife and another knife. Oh, the deconstruction room actually isn't connected to this room. Oh, uh, neat. Uh, you can go to... Can I get to there from one of the halls? Uh, uh, I, think, yeah, I think it's not this one. No. It's oh, which one? The connected to this laboratory? Room. Yeah. Okay, well, I'd so like to go to a like... place that's connected to here. Go up through there. Yeah, and then to No, the I only have one action. Once I'm in the halls to move to, I'd like to go to a place that's connected to Well, you can place. also discard a card. 
to move here. Oh, my cards are precious. I'm not going to destroy them anyway. This one lets you go here and here. Can I just... Oh, I can't get to anything else. From it. Yeah, I'll discard yeah. a card then. Yeah. Okay. I misunderstood. Get out here, David Renfield. Would you like to go to the Great Library or the oh, Towers yeah. of Nakata? Take me to the library. Sure. Uh, so, this is Shroud of Two, and there's just four clues. I've never, it's so weird seeing just four there. Mm -hmm. As an action, spend three clues, so one per investigator. Test book three to decipher the information you found. If you succeed, remember that you have found the process. At the end of the round, if there are four, fewer than four clues on the Great Library, add clues until there are four on it. There's an infinite amount of knowledge here. Three clues? Holy shit. Well, I guess I know I'm doing it for a while. <laughs> Reading books? Yeah. Bryn, do you want to go? Yeah, no, like, I'm going to play these two. Nice. And then do a thing. Um, I'm not going to try and get rid of these anymore. It's cool. I, I accept this. Yeah, but they're soft draws. No, to me, they're not anymore. I'm past yeah, halfway. You, you only have three Brave left. I can give you some liquor soon. Um, it's harder to drink liquor when you're just Egyptian. killing it. Yeah, it's harder to chew. Yeah. I guess I'll move here and see what this place is. They sure. drink poison. Yeah. So one has two shroud, six clues. Whoa. Action: discard any number of cards from your hand, shuffle your discard pile into your deck, and draw cards equal to one more than the number of cards you discarded. Limit once per turn. Victory two. Oh, I'm not losing to that card anymore. Yep. Yeah. Those are your actions. Yep. Cool. Action number one. I have some lock picks. I'm gonna use these to investigate <laughs> kind of four to two. Two claw hands like flailing blades <laughs> around me. Like danger to self and others. <laughs> uh, nice I tip. pass. Um, I have two actions remaining. Uh, let's uh, investigate. I'm gonna use this to go four to two again because you know. I want to pass. Yeah, we've all got our, uh, we've all got distinct items, so we can differentiate each other. Let me get these out. It's like, that guy's got knives, that's probably, uh, Leo. Yeah. That guy's got a shiny thing that's probably, and his head's smoking or whatever. It's probably fun. I think that's the guy getting hit by the shriveling. Uh, no, no, I think that's like, just how... You have the shiny, the shiny crystal. Yeah, yeah. No, no, I think your head just, like, smokes. Oh, well, you okay. know shriveling. <laughs> and then you got lockpicks. Yep. Man, that hit is looking so real much sneaky. Less good when your numbers are two and two. <laughs> yep, yep. But I'll still take them. Like it's better than not doing it. Uh, and around resource and card. I didn't discard a million. Uh. <laughs> These uh, cards are actually good though. Doom. Friend. Four. Five. Six. Sure. So what are our thoughts? What's the shroud here? It's two. It's two. Fine. What are our thoughts? I put you underneath the fog. Of makes sense. Liquid courage. Should I just forgo it? Because it's is harder to drink. I mean, like, don't discard it. Oh, I was gonna use it for the test. Oh, I'm like yeah, go for it. Sure. I don't care. <laughs> for the <laughs> <Pretty light>. <laughs> Oh, fuck. I take two. But if only has some liquor to drink that way. Yep. No, I guess it'll probably just, like, kill Yithians. Yeah. They have the constitution of a wet noodle. All right, it's our turns. Doing the investigating. Four to four. I got a real stat. This is higher than my normal one is. <laughs> Because I don't like that. I don't care about that one. It's got the same shroud. Yeah, but like I want to break this with scaring fog, and this one has infinite clues. It also is one of our objectives. Yeah. That's not important. Uh, okay. Try it again. You're four to four? Yeah. Do you know who would be great here? Min. Yep. She would. Let's call her up. Oh, we're in a different timeline. We need help. Let's uh go four to two. With these yeah, but if it's a different timeline, maybe oh, it's fuck. like Min from Arkham Horror. 
Or Eldritch, or <laughs> she's just dirt. <laughs> um. You know what time it is. It's the 4 to 2 time. I wish I could test at an advantage. That would be kind of neat. Huh? You can do the thing, Justin? Uh, no, because that'll make him. I think I'm going to make the custodian my priority. Okay. Hello, friend. That's a book three. I really don't want to fail. Um, so I think for my last two, we're just going to grab clues to make it so we can talk to him better in the future. Bryn. I'm going to use the action here to discard any number of cards from my hand and shuffle everything back. And I'll discard three cards and draw to four. draw four cards. Neat. And then I'll start moving out of here. Uh, like one, two. Nice. Squeeze in. Because I can just, I sh well, I could maybe kill that guy. Yeah, that'd be good. That'd be nice. Could happen. Doom and evil cards. Uh, like thing, thing. Yep. I should do that, and then I have to discard a card from my hand. Uh, get out of here, emergency cash. You don't discard for pips. <laughs> <laughs> it does brain zero regardless of whether the skill succeeds or fails? Choose and discard all but X cards from your hand. X is the modified skill value for this test. Man, I'm like I almost dead. Cannot improve. Bread. This is almost. It's this guy. You can fight as well as he can. No. <laughs> That's not true. I oh, no, you Yeah. <laughs> That's right. All right, brain is too. <clears throat> oh, I might just do this. Minus three, fuck. Choose and discard all but zero. Oh, no. That sucks. Um, would you still come want to come and fight this guy? Yeah, I think like this is gone too, right? Yeah, yeah this is Well, then how about you yeah. just take it? I just sure. don't want this. Save some actions. And I'll get a resource. I will continue. Take brain damage. Oh, that sucks. <clears throat> I just need it to pass by one. Alright, pal. <laughs> well, I'm gonna investigate this place. Four to four. <clears throat> just like one time again. Thank you. <laughs> Give me a quick look. And the shroud is gone? Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna look at the top card of the deck. With Lisa. It's fine. It's, oh. it's fine. Like, Spoiler alert. I'm going to take it to get the rest of the clues here. And then for my last action, I'm going to do this. I only get one of these. Mm. Oh, it's just draw one? Yeah, and I get two clues. This is a book three test. Oh, this should be back up. This will go back to four at the end four. of the round. I'll come to this flashlight for five, six. Six to three. And it expands your clues. Yeah. Great. Oh. Uh, and my turn, I'll test this frozen fear. For three, three. It's okay, I'm not leaving here forever. <laughs> okay. Alright, pal, you like chop? I'll give you chop. <sighs> I cut three to two. Minus, Minus one, because I have no cards. He's fucking dead. You like that? He's like, what <laughs> is that strange apparatus? <laughs> <laughs> Why did we make knives? I'm going to move in here. Cool. Because I can't draw cards. Um, let's try talking to Mr. Custodian. When you must tell us what these are for, and you're like... <laughs> like, I'll show you. Uh, I'm going to go four to, th four to three. We're going to go five to three. <clears throat> oh, please, for the love of all that is holy. Yes! <laughs> Hello, friend. Wait, you have to do this like multiple times? Three times. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> this one's hard. <laughs> this one's hard. Um, no, no, I'm not like Knife Man. I won't stab you. <laughs> please be friend. I need to go to five <laughs> again. Just, like, covered in slime. Like. 
Yeah. Oh, we go Haley, a little oh, five Haley, to three. Just kiss me, just like. <laughs> Please, for the love of God, again. <gasps> yes! Uh, uh, and then for my last two actions, we're just going to gain clues because I need those to do things. And by clues, I mean resources. Mm. Card and resource? Bye. Sick. Oh, you're really good. I should go to those towers and do that. That fills up with clues again. Thank you. Because I want to get this back my deck for my weaknesses. Bong. Mm. This could kill me. Oh, you're in my location, Brid? I have yeah. four. So oh, sick. Sick. Oh. <laughs> so I fail. I'm done. I'm at one now. It's, yeah, it's because you went up to... Because I go up to six. six. Minus five is one. I fail by two. Take two. Jesus. All right. Okay. I also have that. I'm gonna use this cat burglar. I see how it is. Yeah, I don't need cat burglar. I'm not gonna play him. My resources are for tests. Thank you, cat burglar. What was yours, Travis? I'm thinking about it, so. Sure. It sucks. This just seems like a bad time. Oh yeah, that would have I'm glad we killed yeah. this guy. No, put me at one. I didn't realize you have so much horror on you. Yeah, it's been just happening. Yep. All right, our actions. I roll into this tower's place. And I'm gonna do some cycling. Uh, it's not connected from here. Oh my god. Yeah, you'd have to, you have to like walk back. You can discard a card here though, to like move in here. Right? No, well, only hollow, oh, okay. only hollow oh, open off this. Yeah. I mean like, I'm still gonna move there. I'm so, gonna use the action because I have two pieces left. And I don't want to drive. <clears throat> Discards. Two cards, I guess. Oh man, no, I have this frozen sure I can't do that. Fuck. What is it? <laughs> Maybe bad things just won't happen. Maybe. <laughs> okay, instead we're just going to, uh, oh, we're going to use Alyssa, that's fine, I guess, I'm going to use emergency cash, and I'm just going to investigate here, 4-2, good, mm. I'll investigate here, 4-2. All right, Justin, here's the, here's the plan. Mm -hmm. Good. You're going to get Test this guy. Yep. Three, two. And then I'm going to kill this guy. And we're going to do this thing. Okay. What if you go first? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, that's fine. I can't actually take this action or try to do anything okay. here because I'm afraid of Yithians, except when I'm chopping them. I can cancel this. You can still chop a Yithian? Yeah, like I can still chop them, but I'm not allowed to investigate at a location that has a Yithian. Yeah, that'll do it. Yeah. Um, you guys deserve it. I'll play Beat Cop. Oh, he's great. He is great. God is here. And his name is Beat Cop. And his name is Beat Cop. You know what? I can actually take, like, infinite meat damage. I haven't taken that yet. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, I've only taken one. I'll engage this guy. So we have one this isn't a very scary place, God. like, in terms of meat damage. It's just, like, hey, four to four. Four to four. Chop a DX. That's cool. I will use V-Cop to deal him one, though. Cool. All right. I think we're going to start by drawing a card. I can't do that. Action two, let's investigate. I have two, three, four. We're going to do four. Four to three. Oh, that worked better than I thought it was going to. Um, then like do this thing. Yeah, test foot three. So you got friend. We're gonna go three to three. Minus one. I think we're lucky. 
Perfect. And we advance this. Yep. Oh, fuck, man. Uh, you believe you have discovered the process used by the Yithians to transport you here. But the truth is harder to accept. Your body was never brought to this place. Your mind's been transferred into the body of one of these creatures. Somewhere in another place, in another time, one of these reviled creatures dwells in your body. Great. You no longer have to perform any of the following tasks. However, the more you perform by the time the scenario ends, the easier the transition to your human body will be, and the less likely the process is to fail or backfire. Then it says in bold, with three dots after, be careful. Place this act in the reminder, in the victory display, to remind what you need mm -hmm. to do. So, we... Still need to find the process, dissect an organ, and realize what year it was. Yep. Repossession. You've gathered the knowledge necessary to repossess your body before you can initiate the process. You must expand your mind. Each of them is a <clears throat> hunter. Action. Spend a clue. Draw. Draw two cards instead of one. If your hand exceeds your maximum hand size, draw one additional card. Objective of each surviving investigator is to turn more cards in his or her hand and immediately advance. And beware. Remember to complete as many of the tasks act, listen and act to be as you can. They're really pushing that. This one is, uh, this one's spooky. I like you better do so it. I have no cards in my hand, and I'm not currently allowed to take draw actions. Yeah, we gotta work on that. Uh, on, if, when you're in my location, you get to draw one card with the other custodian. Oh, okay. So you get to draw two cards by your next turn. So. Just don't play cards. Um, those are my actions. We go to the enemy phase. This guy's gonna bonk you some damage. I'll survive on life. It seems good. So we're five <clears throat> before this thing. Why? <laughs> Why so hard? Bong. So I draw two cards? No, you're going to get one, then oh, at the okay. start of the investigator phase, you get another. So. Sweet. I already did bomb. Um, let's advance this, please. Shove the encounter discard pile into the encounter deck. If the custodian's in play and not we controlled by... These. Oh, yeah. Oh, thank God. Um, if an investigator has a pendant, that investigator reads the following. I don't have a pendant. You don't have it in this one? No. No, we don't have the pendant? No. Oh, no! No, we don't. Fuck. I'll let you guys talk me out of taking it. That is so funny. It, you get to draw two cards, and you're no longer affected by things that reduce maximum hand size. Oh, that'd be neat. So I have a crystalline elder sign as like a pendant. Uh, humanity yes, fading. Is. How long has it been here? Been days, weeks, years? Each investigator's maximum hand size is reduced by four. That's okay, oh, we're good. still we're still in like a reasonable spot, I think. <clears throat> well, we have to get to like ten cards, right? Yeah. Each surviving investigator has ten or more cards. If one of us dies, that's fine. <laughs> If you're going to die, Travis, can you give me your crystalline elder sign? Can we do a trade action in this game? No. This game's too hard. Uh, I have a strange feeling this might become the Finn adventure soon. <laughs> Finn and the Yankees. Yeah. <laughs> For you. Thanks. For me. Can't play assets or events. Do not mind. Frozen in fear. Sign me up, game. All right. Investigating. Four to two. Oh, Bryn, you and I should draw a card. Give a clue. Investigate in 42. <clears throat> give clue. Oh, how many do you have in hand? Minus three. So no. No, don't go. Give clue. Investigate in 42. Nope. Man. <laughs> I've done nothing the last like four times. <laughs> So bad. I should have a resource. <clears throat> okay. Um. If I draw that serpent of the egg, I'm just gonna get fucked. Fifteen. Rough, rough. I might, I, I might need to. 
go to the towers just to restock my deck. Yeah, I know. I suppose awesome. like I can use this once per turn to draw an extra card. Yep. Yep. That doesn't get me anywhere near where I need to be though. Nope. Like I can be at eight. No, not even. I because like max hand size is four. Go get some clues, nerd. Until you can juice up that like. That's a draw action. Yeah, that's what can be your thing. To take that. Well, then get rid of them. <clears throat> So how many of these do you think we should do? Like five. If we, like all of them if we can. Yeah, I don't think we can. I think we start considering leaving once it hits like five clues. Cool. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go into the orrery. Action number one and two. Uh, if there are no clues here, you remember what year it is. Four shroud, three clues. Yeah. Um, action number two. Oh, action number three, sorry. We're going to investigate four to four. There's no penalty right now. Nope. Um, I guess we're gonna gain some resources. We're gonna test our frozen in fear. We're gonna go four to three. Hmm. That's good, that's not. Mm. <laughs> See another round? Not yet, we still have to draw cards and stuff. Uh, I don't think Brennan's gone either. Good. I don't want to be a Yithian. Well, then we're going to shit together. I'm trying my darndest. Yeah, I don't need to. I'm just going to die here. Mm. I'll be honest, like, for the Yithian thing, it's not even that awful for me. Yeah. Like, losing this sucks. But, like, all my good cards are just skills and stuff anyway. And yeah. events anyway. Yeah. Mine is also... I mean, like, this hyper-awareness has been very helpful for... Yeah. I like to say Lissy Ground has been helpful, but, like, I just keep failing tests anyway, so... Like, whatever. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. I don't need this anymore. I'm not going to do anything with it before the, the round ends. Have you been taking your turn? Oh, yeah. I investigated one time successfully. Right. I remember that. Yeah. It's the same as, like, the last... It's better than the last, like, three turns, actually. <clears throat> I don't... I'm, like, both excited to see how our decks will fare when we build it, knowing the knowledge of this is, but I also, like, forgot an age. I'm like, nah, it's okay. You can, you can wait for a bit. Maybe we'll do another playthrough card coast or something before we do this one again. I agree with that. That's probably a good idea. Yeah. Maybe by the time this one's finished... Uh, then we'll have... Uh, Down which Legacy extra. Oh, I'm excited time. for that. I'm not sure <clears throat> it's because I've played it so many times. Down which Legacy feels like pretty mad to me now. Oh, yeah. You have, it, I'm currently on like my... Sixth playthrough of it? Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's tough to be him. Okay. But no, you should just uh, take me through this one next. And just. <laughs> Bring your up. Lose. It's your turn, Bren. Turn you back on and go for it, Leo. Now we're gonna Stab him. give him some chop. Four to four. Nope. Try again. <gasps> he's dead. He's he's dead, and you have an action. Amazing. Now what? I actually hadn't considered this possibility. Go check out the deconstruction chamber and see if there's anything interesting there. That's the one that has fist. I remember because we I, accidentally We don't know peaked. that. That's why I say go check out what's there, Justin. It's a fist. <sighs> yes, Sprinkle, there you a good fist. You can also know. Or like start running 
getting these out of here. Yeah, I've got a plan to deal with those. Oh, I think. It's not great. Oh, it's like pretty, pretty soft. Oh. <clears throat> but uh, we're going to start out by gaining a resource. And that's our extra thing. Mm -hmm. Cool. Resource and cards. Oh, card. that's a happy draw. Get out of here, decorated skull. Discard down the four cards. God. Doom. Three. Evil card for you. Evil card for you. <laughs> He is aloof until we find the process or discover what year it is. We've done neither of those things, right? Yeah, that's correct. That's what I'm trying to do, though. Mm -hmm. So Cal, show him good when he comes to get me. I'm also trying to find the year. <laughs> is there any way that you can finish your sister? Okay. I mean, unless I get really lucky. Ben, what'd you get? Oh, he probably got a pact with the Yogg-Soth off. Because he's thinking and he hasn't said anything. Well, he should just explode the beat cop. Yeah, but without that beat cop, there's not much point in having any of my stuff. Oh, yeah, I mean, like, get out of here, pal. I've also drawn that card twice. It could be really good. Mm-hmm. All right. Investigate in the great library. <laughs> Oh, nope. before. Hang on, we're gonna look with a list of this turn first. I'm gonna move the powers of Noctis. <laughs> and I can't do this because I've got the stupid Ethan presence. God. What? Never mind, I'm gonna stay there. I'm gonna. <laughs> hmm. Well, you. Can't you trigger it this turn? Because you're not frozen in fear? No, I have this. Yeah, it says if there's one on your space, though. Right? Oh, if there's a Yithian, I'll look yeah, Oh, yeah, okay, no, then I'll go do that. Yithian. Okay, good. I'm not discarding anything. These cards are great, and I don't want to lose them. Cool. And that's all I do this turn. I'm going to gain two resources and play Brother Xavier. Don't you... What was your first action? I moved to the halls, and I moved to the different halls. And I moved yeah, here. Yeah, like, this place isn't connected here, right? Oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Through yeah. here. I'm gonna draw like one. <clears throat> oh, we're discarding that like immediately next turn. Maybe I'll just stay here and get the clues. <laughs> oh, Bryn, you and I each draw a card at the start of the turn. I wasn't on your location. Oh, that's right. Ooh! Not that it would matter. I wouldn't. Ha I would have to discard it anyway. What mm -hmm. chance? Do we have to dis do we have to discover the process? No, but the more we do, the better. They've said like on three different cards that we should do as many as we can. Which we're not the hook this one. Yep. Yeah. Well, it's not matching. Right, because we can hang out here, right? Mm-hmm. I'm probably going to have to go to the tower soon to refresh. So, like, we're, we're not doing this one, right? Yeah, I don't think we will. Like but for sure. We can, if we can get this one and then, like, maybe this one on a good day. Yeah, like, I can... I mean, Travis might be able to get this one in passing if he grabs two clues here and then flips this one, right? Yeah. But then we essentially need to... Basically, then it becomes a liability the more people that are left surviving at the end of the game. Yeah. Right. Uh, like I think if we can get these two, mm -hmm. we're probably in pretty good shape. Yeah, I agree. I think that's I think that should be the plan now. <clears throat> Having this sealed really sucks now, because <laughs> we know this needs a three, right? Mm -hmm. I can pitch cards to be good at that though. Are you going over here? Um, I'm playing Brothers. I played Brothers Xavier. Yes. Get money, play Brothers mm -hmm. Xavier. Okay. So this time. I can go? Yeah. Alright, well, let's start by trying to pick a lock. We're going to be 4 to 4. Because I don't really want to die if I take any more horror damage yeah. at all. 
That's a fail. I am upset with you right now, game. Two, three, four. Why do you need to be there? I, I'm at the point where if I draw that card and fail, I instantly will get killed. Because I only have like 11 cards left in here. You won't draw it. I won't? Oh, okay. I will Pretty not sure. do that then. You'll draw it. <laughs> like I'm All right, well, reasonably confident. And... Then we're going to investigate. <laughs> four to four. We're going to go five to four. <clears throat> Alright, so Travis, I think we're abandoning this one. Why? Because it's gonna be too hard to do. Also, this guy will be here and he'll be like all punchy. That's fine, I got Shohan. I haven't used yet. Um, two actions left, we're gonna go like this. And then we're going to test our Frozen and Fear. We have this Moxie to make it four to three. Nice. I wanna die! I wanna die! Alright, end of turn. <laughs> Resources and cards, anything with Hunter, which is none. Really might get that. Mm. Choose this card all but one card in your hand, huh? Well, that's just the flavor of this game. Bong. Game like this one's hard enough. Sweet. There's oh, nothing left here. That's good. It's the action here. Yeah, yeah so we don't even care. I got man. Help, I got man. All right. So Travis, I think we have to try and do like these two. Okay. Just because like, it's like the only reason is this one instead of this one is because this one's closer to this space and this is where we want to be to draw up okay. to 10 because here your max hand size is increased by two. Well, I'll get there one day. Um. Gonna try and get these cruel interrogations, I think. With a bring I like the top card of the bad deck. I like a Dean Dice, please. That good, huh? Yeah, that's no bueno. <laughs> the card's worth more than one Dean for sure. Um, Alright, Alyssa, you ready to fucking die? Test in the school. Yes, you're. You know what's up. <laughs> Minus one. It's five or more? Yeah. Sweet. Yeah, this is two. I have three. Okay, okay. Hmm. So, you guys just want me to soak clues here? Uh, well, you, like, you can't do anything else this turn, right? I can like move. That costs two. Yeah. Like oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, like, the first thing wasn't an action. I don't know. No, I'll uh, just, uh, I'll just suck these. Four to two. I'm coming to punch Justin's guy. Come to punch Justin. Give me a clue. No, I'm not at that awful library. I'm feeling new. Vigorated, give me a clue. Doing things. The problem in the library is there's too much knowledge. Test this if there was an fear. I'll just do it. All right. Remove it from the game. Oh yeah. Brian, we can't just endlessly recycle these. This is garbage. All right. Um. I would be sick of this campaign. Silas. Yeah. If only that book would be released. Come in with the. It has been released. Just would not reprint. I'm Come not going to engage it. Yeah, that's fine. You're not going to hit me. Silas Marsh. I'll punch. All the skill guys. Like, and but then it's like, but then we're stuck in the, <laughs> in the jungle. <laughs> we'll bring like one. We'll bring like a green gal. Yeah, like I'll, I'll attack it three to two. 
Hmm. Yeah, your cat I has no you. sense of personal boundaries. Nope. He followed me. Let's try again. Yeah, I'll try it's only one damage. Him. He's like trying to get my attention. Yeah. <laughs> Unless. Just need to turn me back on. Hmm. Hmm. I need to find a way to kill Alyssa. Like that Yithian. <laughs> you have your turn left, right? Yeah. That's what we'll do. We're um, gonna taking damage from this is like super bad. Oh, that's but right. I don't think I can stop it. Um, you can't even kill him this turn. It's, uh, no, it's not possible. Like, I yeah. could possibly do a damage to him, but... Yeah, okay, then I, I won't do what I was going to do. Yeah. At this, like, at this stage. We're going to pick some locks at a resounding 4-4. Four to four. Uh, We will spend two of these to go 6-4. to four. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Um, action two. This should be a four. Um, I would really like to pass this. So, it's four. I'm at two. I can spend all these to go to six. Six to two. Six to four, sorry. I want to die. <laughs> That's turn. Neat. Enemy phase. Test your frozen here. Thank you. Um, I don't draw this until afterwards. If you can buff this somehow, that's probably for the best. Three billion? Yeah. Six to three. Boom. Um, These two. Uh oh. Uh oh! Xavier's gonna take it so I don't die. I'll attack him with my survival knife. So we've got four to two. Fuck you again. Uh, draw and get a resource. Sick. All right. Bomb. appeared. Fuck. Stop. <laughs> Minus one, eh? Alright, well, we fail. Let's spend this drama of flame for plus two brain. Uh, we'll discard five. Survival knife. Minus one is four. That's Just the number of I get to draw a card, right? <laughs> Bryn, you get a card off this guy? Cool. Fuck. Alright, well, like, I'll yeah, go four. first then, I guess. That's like, I'll five. give him some chop. That's six. Oh, minus one. Chop of the dead. Um, if you engage him and chop him, I can give you some help. Unless you have something else you can do on your turn. Like, not a whole lot. No, I'm like, I'll take this boy. I have this nice bow I bought that's pretty bad here. <laughs> yeah. That's fair. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Next game. Oh. Uh, I mean, like, this guy's dead, though. Either discard each ally in my hand. Justin, do you think you get this each... clue this turn? I'm hope... Cool. Yeah, all right. Probably not. Later, pal. To be realistic. I mean, I could just... They can make it my objective to get it and potentially get it, succeed. Okay. 
Because if I, for example, go this and investigate, I will do six to four. Mm -hmm. There's only one minus three and a minus five in an auto fail. Those are the only bad ones, right? Okay. So that's a pretty good chance of getting there. Okay. And then I can activate this. Uh, I'll this turn. resource, I guess. Okay. Do okay. you, you, you want to go that. first? Because this fucker will... No, I don't get to gain a resource. I'm out of actions. This fucker won't be aloof if I go before you. It's going to be aloof here. Okay. Can you try to activate that thing again? Huh? No, that's three actions. One, two, three. Oh, fuck. That's right, because this map... No, I've got... It's fine. I think you don't have time for this. I think I do. But if we do this one, we can ignore this one, right? Right, but then he still like needs to get ten cards in his hand. Or oh, not. yeah, no. I think right? I think the goal should be, realistically, only one of us is going to make it with the, the hands. So this one we're going to take up to four. Next time I'm going to kill this guy and then do the thing. I'm going to go up to five. And then, like, see here and fucking draw cards or whatever. So I'm going to spend three actions... To do this, because I really want to get yeah, this. Yeah, but like any sitting anywhere but here, you can't spend enough actions to draw that many cards. Yeah, that's fine. Um, we're gonna pick a lock. I am currently four to four. I'll spend three of these to go seven to four. Now, game, listen to me. All right, those are my actions. And to turn, resources and cards. So I'm knocking with a dice that I don't want to. He's got five brain damage. Did you do the thing? No, I'm gonna do it next turn. I mean, I can just go before you, right? And really, I was hoping that uh, he would. You do it last turn. So this guy snapped to me and kill this last turn. Mm. Discard an asset you control the custodian. What? It's probably gonna be lockpicks reasonably. My left fix should be fucking broken. And scan this guy, your hyper awareness, whatever, because you don't get that anymore. Uh, do the lock picks get discarded if there are no tokens on them? No. Perfect. I'll just discard that then. Minus two if you feel put clue down. Fuck. That's, That's incredible. That's incredible. I want to die. So you want to fight this guy? You want him to attack and kill? No, I'm just going to do it differently this turn. Okay. I'm going to spend an action and dumpster two counter spells from my hand to get rid of this. Then I'm going to spend an action. I'm going to interact with this. I'm going to succeed. Nice. So what's this one? This one is... If you found the process, so then this guy will engage you. Yep, found the process. Yeah. And then I get to draw a card off of uh, Guts? this oh. the star. That's right. We're going to spin a lesson with top card in the deck. Three kids upstairs. Mm -hmm. I have feel the enemies burn. Like not great. Can't hold on to that. How much fight does it have? Like many. Mm. Was it an observer? Yeah. Yeah, that's what. Doom. I'm gonna shrivel this guy for my last action. Yeah, she gets a doom. Hmm? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. <laughs> She's not gonna live much longer. Yeah. I'm on five. <clears throat> Oh, it takes two damage. Nerd. That's my turn. <laughs> I wish you had a money sinker too. Alright. Yeah. Uh, you take a horror damage though, right? Why? Because you revealed a skull. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like bad, bad, not good. I don't know if that matters. I'm just not going to reveal that one next turn, it'll be fine. Let's 
scan a resource. We're going to investigate here. I have four. Fucking five, six, seven. I want to pass. Minus two. Minus three. Minus two. Minus two. Oh, yeah, yeah wait, sorry. Sons. I was talking two sons. Those are similar colors. Um, my last two actions, I will um, realize what year it is. 2018. Mm -hmm. Cool. Um, I'll give this guy some chop because he'll kill me. What year is it? Current year. Uh, discard. Machete. Four plus two. Machete. Oh my god. Sick. Mm. I have my two weaknesses still in here. Yeah, that's why I can reshuffle. Yeah. That's a good one. Like, isn't that bad? Well, it's just the fact that I'm going to have two dead draws mm. trying to get to ten. Yeah, I guess. And you do have to draw them, don't you? Mm hmm I mean, the alternative is if I make my way here and do it there, um, because I can draw nine cards. Brent, I kind of need this custodian, I think, though. Oh, I mean, oh, yeah, but the thing is, I realistically, I don't know what the odds are of all of us being able to escape. Like, like pretty low. Yeah, but, like, as long as we're alive. Yeah, but that's what mm -hmm. I'm saying, right? Like, we might need like, to... We still have to, like, dying is not... Necessarily an option. Yeah, well, because you can't draw cards. Yeah, and that's probably going to be the way this is for the rest of the game. Because then, if, but, but then, uh, if, like, if I'm sitting at six and I'm sitting on the space that, yeah, then I can't even draw more cards. So yeah, check out that deconstruction room. Yeah. Let's fucking go over here. I'm not rumbling this guy for nothing. Fist this, get four. The <sighs> Making attempts to retrieve. This test gets plus one. I need somebody else here. <laughs> Just holy shit. Uh, the test is like fucking fist seven right now holy fuck if we can make it a little easier but yeah that's my turn okay this guy kills Alyssa see ya that's my card that's your card or you die you get upgraded to being like on camera buddy look at you key for the great library <laughs> bad cards oh we get money in a card though I have to discard one now. They lock the library. They said enough's enough. These guys aren't Yothians. Three. I don't even know what that is. Let's just run it out. Four, five. Minus two. All right, well, let's fail by five. Six. Mitch Brown. Disaster. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Lockings gotta go right this turn, Justin. I have Pardon? a zap. Lockings gotta go right this turn. <laughs> fewer than ten? It's fewer than ten. Jeez. So. Okay, that's one of them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got to talk. We got to figure out what we're gonna do. Well, I'm gonna fight this keeper of the great library. Let's start there. Yeah, because if you get a skull, that's just it. Yeah, right? it's yeah. explode. <laughs> yeah, a skull, any symbol. Yeah, any of the bad ones. It's, yeah. it, it, it is how it is. Yeah, we'll start there, and then adapt. Mm -hmm. <gasps> I think I fail. One, two, three, four. Oh no, he explodes. Nice. This one's also move the game. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm coming towards you guys. Move here. Um. Yeah, I'll throw away this move here for two. Or for free, and then I'll move like here. Little fronts. Are we going to try and do this deconstruction room? No, I don't think there's time. Okay. Because we have next turn. Is anyone playing Guts? Mine are both, mine are used. 
track days. Maybe we suck it up and do five. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, I think we just have there's there's no way we're gonna get them all. I like I think there's enough actions if we do good. If we do good. <laughs> so like, I need to be test this. It'd be real close. Checking that brain test nope. and failing that brain test. Yep. Checks out. I'm drawing four cards. Let's see how many are my weaknesses. One of them is, can you please note that uh, the hour is nigh. How do you spell nigh? N-I-G-H. This guy's going to spell it like nay. <laughs> the hour is nay. <laughs> I'm actually going to, yeah. Um, resources and cards. Can't you just spell it down? Oh yeah, I have a shriveling. Well, I mean, like if I get this, the thing, I just die. This the shriveling, so that's pretty bad. <laughs> like I can just hear him punch him for a bit, I guess. But like, also need your dark cards. Serpent's a geeky dick. I spent so I worked so hard to not have you show up. <laughs> All right, uh, Doom. Evil cards. So this is the last turn, eh? Yep. Oh, that's gonna hit your brain too. Oh, we'll get in here. Plus two shroud. I don't think I can do it. Yeah, me neither. How many cards are left in your deck, Justin? Two. Okay. But. One's a weakness, but I can draw nine cards this I can draw ten cards this turn. Because I still have my clues. Yeah, right, I'm just going to die there. There is no possible draw that stops me from dying. Yeah. Well, you need to get the ten cards. Pardon? You get to ten cards. Yeah. Well, we all need to get there. Oh, no, I'm just going to do a thing and let this guy hit and kill me. Okay. Okay. Yeah, better than, yeah. Wait till I see if I can actually do it. Yeah. All right, well, we're going to spend a clue to draw three. Uh, one is... Actually, no, hang on, sorry. Are you, you're not going to make any tests, are you? No. Okay, never mind then. Yeah, I was just... like, I'll go first and get these things back in the bag. <laughs> Uh, we'll take one direct. Uh, this will go here. Um, I have. We'll draw. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, we draw a card off this guy. Thanks, Justin. And then I'll draw three more. Justin just draws paranoia, discards all but one. Burn. Sick. Cool. You done? Yep. You got 10 cards? Yep. Justin, save me. No. I die. To brain damage. Uh, the machine whirs with the intense vibration has taken many hours to construct, and you've had to build it in secret using the knowledge you've gathered from the various areas within the city. It's a strange device of rods, wheels, and glass about the size of a small filing cabinet. A circular mirror in the center sends your alien reflection staring back at you. You activate the device and you feel a tugging on your psyche, stretching your conscious uh, across the aether of space and time. The memories come flooding back. R1. You wake on the cold stone surface of the cavern floor, your mind dizzy from its journey through time and space. Uh, the process was successful. Each investigator earns two bonus experiences. Here she gains insight into the earth. Victory X. Uh, one, two, nice. Who's on this one? Yeah, three. 
Three total? Three total. Three on there. Three on here, okay, yes. Five total. Yeah. You're only four. Those held captive. In the campaign log, the process did not backfire. Sweet. Follow the following, so we don't have those. That one was stressful. It too nice. Okay. I just feel stressed. Oh, you guys are removed from my deck. Check the Chaos Wagon campaign log. So we don't have two more tombstones in the bag, so we get forever lost. You turn your attention to your surroundings. Both Alejandro and the creatures that ambush you were nowhere to be found. You wonder how long Alejandro was in league with them and why. Perhaps you will never know. However, you expect this is not the last you will see of him. Record that Alejandro is set against you. Yeah, he is. Yeah, ever since he was all like, we should kill all these people. Yeah. <laughs> you never trust the colonizer. Never. He's removed from my deck first, the campaign. I don't think I'm going to look back, assuming I get it. Oh, fuck. The narrow steps on either side, the other side of the stone doorway seem almost endless. Through a dim red glow emanates from deeper within the cavern. No matter how many steps you traverse, the glow does not brighten. It almost seems to go more distant with each step, mocking your tenacity. After a short while, you come to a small edge where a stone gate bars your passage deeper into the cavern. The gate bears a familiar card pattern, faded from age and disrepair, seeping with an oddly discolored purulence. We have chalk. No, that's stupid why we have chalk. <laughs> the way is shut. It was You're made by those who are unsure dead. how to succeed. How to proceed. After debating the merits of each of your options, you decide the brute force may be the only solution. It takes all of your strength to lift the stone and you open the way forward for each of you one at a time. It is no simple task and your body aches tremendously with the effort. No mulligans next turn. What was this? Check your supplies. This is medicine time? No, this is eating food. Oh, we still need to eat, huh? <laughs> no rations, right? Nope. Cool, we starve. Minus three. <laughs> oh, I get to start with zero. Huh? That's pretty neat. <laughs> that seems like a good strategy. Check uh, your supplies. Yeah. Each pro investigator with medicine can heal someone. Um, you have more mental trauma mm -hmm. and less stats, so you should take the healing. Okay. I'm not even worried about mine. You it's, can it's suck okay. my fucking balls. <laughs> yeah, it's because your doom approaches, isn't it? The poison spreads uh, no, I, have, I still have three more draws. Okay, okay. Yeah. Nearly every part of your body, your skin pales, and you're covered in cold, feverish sweat. Simply rising to your feet requires a tremendous effort, and you get no rest at night despite your exhaustion. It won't be long now before the poison claims your life. You suffer one physical drama. After saying hundreds and hundreds of steps, you decide to stop and rest. Though your watch tells you the night has fallen, the lack of natural sky is starting to affect your internal clock. With no flat ledge in sight, each member of your party claims one of the many narrow steps to sleep on. He's got the two of us have link, it's just you don't. So we're going to pick axe instead. Justin, you get a physical or mental trauma of your choice. Where's... No, oh, I'm still 7-7. Seven, seven. Bring me a nap. On the Give good. me physical. <laughs> Give me physical. Okay. To be continued. No one's a Yithian forever. I thought for sure that was what was, like, being driven insane was going to do. No. Uh, if the process backfired... How does this... How, how did it... What made it successful? We did five things. Oh, so less than five. Holy yeah. shit. Six gets you two extra experience each. Uh, four is like you get one experience. The process backfired. Three were completed. So what happens when it's backfired? Then like you're done. Uh, if you fail this one, like everyone just dies. And the game's over. Um... I'm gonna be okay with being a yith forever. Mm-hmm. Uh, sorry, and then like, 
Yeah. So if the process like backfired, each investigator right reveals a random chaos token from the chaos bag, and then you consult the list below to see what side effects result from the mishap. If it backfires spectacularly, you reveal two and choose the one that's lower. If you get star plus one, you have no ill effects. If you get skull, or any number other than plus one, you get the out of body experience weakness and must add to your deck. And if you get a bad token that isn't a skull, your body will get the end forever. So getting four is not the end of the world. You can still just get out with a weakness more often than not. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's good to know for the next time that we bring Silas Marsh on a trip to the City of Archives with Min <laughs> as a <his> support. <laughs> Well, uh, next up, we go to the depths of Yoth and... Oh, no, that was not awful. It was stressful. This one was, was very stressful. stressful. I'm mostly just disappointed that they didn't give us mini cards for Yithians. Yeah. Probably have to require a whole new printing sheet, and you wouldn't be able to tell who was mm -hmm. Oh, no, it would require a lot. No, like, personalized. Yeah, there would be, like, each, yeah, there would be four different ones. No, not even four they different ones. They all have different artwork for the mini card, but you just... No, no, they get, like, they give you a body of the Ithium with, like, distinctive features for each investigator who's been released so far. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Very good job, guys. Yeah. Uh, that was a positive resolution. Technically. Yep. No, I think like, objectively that was a positive resolution. Yeah. Looking up with friend number Tron, <laughs> Justin's probably going to die at the end of the next scenario from poison. God, I hope not. Because I, I mean, like, somewhere. I hope that they just, uh... They're just scaring you. Or they just make you... I'm not going to survive the end of the thing. Oh, yeah. Right? Like, it'll be like any investigator's poison. Second last scenario, start a new character. Yeah. I think it'll be like... You die if you're poisoned at the end resolution of the mm -hmm. whole campaign. It's like your character fucking dies, mm -hmm. and no one misses them. This guy's well, gone I think forever. If we need to, if any of us need to make a new character before the thing is over, I think we pick Calvin Wright and just build like Dark Horse Calvin Wright dot deck, mm -hmm. or like Desperate Heat. Yeah, yeah. I think that's a good idea. I think but like, pulse for that because at least you can still do something with like zero level cards. If I die, I'm gonna play Rex. The only thing I wish is that, flavorfully, if your character died while in the depths of Yoth, another investigator doesn't show up being like, Howdy! <laughs> I'm here to help. I'm Ashcan Pete. I got a dog. Got me a dag. Bye. <laughs>